I love me some football. And I'm always looking for the perfect spot to watch the game. Allison on Facebook said we had to come to Austin Saloon in Libertyville. Are you ready for some football? Whoa, Nelly! Let's cheers first cheers. before we start. The starting lineup. Tell me about Austin's. Our fans said this is one of the best spots to come for game day. Why would you say Austin's is Chicago's best? Not only we have 27 plasma TVs, we also have two 10-foot projections. Monday Night Football, we have 50-cent tappers and 50-cent tacos. Being this close to the border, we have a big Green Bay contingency. Yeah, dirty word, but our Bear fans definitely outnumber them. It's a nice rivalry, and everybody has a really good time with it. Who's your favorite team? The Bears, of course. Chicago Bears. The Bears. The Bears. Who else? <laughs> Bears! Now that that's settled, let's talk about the food. We always have a NFL football menu. A little bit of a discount. A little bit more stick to your bones, greasy. It's the type of food that you want to watch to have a beer and really enjoy the game. <laughs> let's get the food going so we're ready for the game. Let's do it. Let's do it. Cheers. <laughs> On the roster tonight, Steak fajitas. What makes it different than everybody else's is the poblano pepper that gives it a nice smoky flavor. The jalapeno and red pepper, yellow pepper, green pepper, and some Vidalia onions. Do you want me to cut some onion? Sure, if you can handle it without crying, let's do it. There's no crying in the kitchen, I got this. No babies in the kitchen. Onto the meat. One of the great things with the marinade is starting with guajillo pepper. Guajillo? Guajillo here, I don't know. It's got a real different flavor to it. Yeah. So after our pepper, we have got our special seasoning that's proprietary to us, lemon juice, just a pinch of cumin, right. and then one of the things that I like the most is Bloody Mary mix in it. Instead of reinventing the wheel, I just did what I like drinking the most. Okay. Coca-Cola gives it a little bit of a caramelizing to the meat as well. Throw the meat in there, and then that'll marinate for about two hours. Let's cook. Whoa, oh well. We are sizzling in the kitchen. We're gonna go ahead and add our vegetables to it. Look how pretty it is. The peppers. Onions, the jalapeno, and the poblano is all starting to get into that meat. You're going to taste it. And, all those uh, great flavors. Yep. So why don't you finish plating these up, and I'm going to head out and talk to some customers. You got it. Game time. Game day is always fun here. There's so many TVs. There's so many fans. Not a bad seat in the house. And everybody's here for the games. And we can't forget about the food. Wow, we finally got to eat. I know, my favorite part. And get some more drinks. Yeah. All right, let's build. That's a perfect fajita. And it's perfect game day food. The meat is so tender. Juicy. That's where the marinade came in and flavored it. Who would have thought? Coca-Cola and some freaking Bloody Mary mix. Okay, now I gotta try this. This is really different. We've got handcuffed fries, cheddar cheese, Monterey Jack, ghost pepper cheese. This is delicious. You get your meat and potatoes all in one dish. I used to do a football cheer. I like it. I like I love it. it. I want some more. I want more. 